Hey y'all. So I am getting a new puppy. Um, this is my first puppy. She is a black French bulldog and her name is Queen. She's a black queen. And I'm super freaking nervous because this is my first puppy. I've been afraid of dogs for 30 years, my whole life. And I was like, you know what? I'm not gonna be afraid of dogs in my 30. I'm getting a puppy. And so I went to the breeder, played with her, and I bought her just like that. So now I'm a, I'm a dog mom, puppy mom, and I'm terrified. Um, so I'm so excited, but I'm also so terrified. So being a new mom, just like if you're the mom of a human child, you go a little overboard with buying stuff. So I'm gonna do my puppy haul based on my research, all the stuff I bought. I did spend over $500 which is an issue but it's okay because queen is gonna be a queen she's royalty um so let me go through my haul i'm gonna tell you what i bought and what i think is essential and what's not essential from what people have told me okay so first we are in queen's castle this is her playpen so luckily i have wooden floors as you can see so um i'm going to lay her potty pads her potty pads on the floor in here um i also subscribed for fresh fresh patch which is a patch of grass delivered every week or every two weeks since my balcony is not necessarily safe for a dog it has holes in it um unless i bring her this outside which i probably will or i'm gonna get her i'll probably bring this outside actually um I'll probably buy another one of these to put outside so that she can actually, her fresh patch is going to be outside so that she can pee outside. That's a wonderful idea. I'm actually going to do it. Um, and inside, I'm going to lay this all over the floor of the, pay pen, the play, pen, play pen so that if she pees in her play pen, we're good. Um, this was $10 potty pads. Okay. I also, for essentials... I got her a crate because she's going to be crate training. You can see right here, a pink crate that folds up and it has a carrier. And in her crate, for now, I have her towel, a towel, a little comfy towel. I'm going to get a more um, comfier blanket as well as her bowl to eat and drink. So they said that you should be feeding her in her crate in the beginning so that she learns to love her crate. And her crate is a happy place. Um... So working on that, I'm also going to buy her some toys to put inside of her crate. I already bought them. They're on the way. Um, I'll include some images of the toys that I'm buying um, below. Um, my niece, my three-year-old niece has told me that her puppy needs to be in her house now. So I'll be traveling really soon with Queen. So I bought this super cute travel bag from Amazon. And it has the mesh top and the mesh side. And it rolls up and clips. So your doggy can breathe, obviously. But then if you want to use it as a regular bag, you can close up all of those sides to it. So this super cute dog carrier bag. I also got Queen Her. Her harness hopefully this fits her i got an extra small um i'm hoping this really hoping this fits her it might not um uh, her harness an extra small i got she's gonna obviously grow into it and the leash the leash oh awesome this has a collar just in case her harness doesn't fit there's a collar wonderful um got this from tj maxx actually um i also have a few I got this bulk trash bag, the doggy six month supply of poop picker uppers. And it has the little holder there for you to hold the little bags when you're picking up the poop and stuff. So that's cute. Um, I also bought her, this is my puppy paw boo, like kangaroo paw boo for me to actually carry her. I know my boobs is gonna be a situation here, but I'm gonna be carrying her in this 
puppy carrier, like a backpack, but on your front side. So that's going to be such cute pictures. Um, I also bought her a car seat. So this actually is going to attach to the front part of my car. Because you want to be safe with your puppy in your car. So the front seat of my car, this is her car seat. Okay. Then I got her two beds. Um, this is a bed. She's not going to be able to get into this easily. This is more of a bed I'm going to have to put her into or she's going to have to wait until she's older. So I need to get a lower one, a lower bed for in her. I'm probably going to use blankets in her crate. Um, and this is what she'll sleep in. She could fall asleep in her crate or I'll place her in here and she could fall asleep in here. I also have another pink castle. One of these coming as well. You know, because, what is that? Oh, because, <laughs> you know, she's a queen. And her toys, I got her this little pink monkey. Either she's going to be afraid or she's going to love it. Who knows? And another pink little whatever this is. So, yes, y'all. I also got... Um, stuff, I'm going to tell you guys stuff I got that is not here. I also got this pooper picker-upper. Pooper scooper. Um, I really hope it works. But it's a scooper. It, it, it opens up into an actual pooper scooper. Like this. And then it eventually, you press the button. And I'll pick up the poop. Scooper, scooper. Um, I also ordered, um, I did a lot of research on what type of food a little puppy um, Frenchie Bulldog should be eating. So I got um, some wild prairie food that's going to be delivered. Um, I also, what I'm really excited to share with you all. Oh, first of all, her outfits. Of course, um, <laughs> this dog's going to be treated like a child. Got her some coming home outfits. Um, she's always gonna she's a fashionista. I'm a I'm a plus size model. My dog is a fashionista So I got her these for her neck these designer collar scarves Cuz she gonna be looking cute and this for her little head and my little baby I also have a special outfit for her that I'm not gonna share because it's a surprise follow us on Instagram Queen and Caroline and her crown a gold crown for a queen stay tuned for those photos okay um and what else oh, the last thing i want to tell you guys that i got is i got i partnered with two brands which i'm so excited to tell you guys about one of them is buddy bottle and it's literally i'm gonna show the picture now it's literally a bottle with a bowl attachment to it so cute small and portable and like if you squeeze it the water comes into the bowl um, so it's like a portable bowl that you can bring around with you um, when you're walking your dog. I also partnered with a company called Whistle. And Whistle, pretty expensive to get the actual device, which is $100. And then the leash, I got a leash. Um, and I got a collar and another collar, which is super cute. You can intertwine them. And it is a GPS health fitness tracker for your dog. And I love that. I'm really sensitive about no one, someone stealing my dog. So it's a GPS tracker, and you can track their sleep, you can track their fitness, and you can track exactly where they are. Um, if ever, you can set it so that if they like leave a location that they're supposed to be at, you get an alert. So it's a really cool um, device, Whistle Caller. Instagram is Whistle Labs. So y'all, this was my puppy haul. Um, let me know if anything's missing. I also ordered some spray um, for smell of pee, this orange spray. Um, and the fresh, fresh patch, as I mentioned. Um, so I think that's most of it. If there's anything missing, let me know. I will be doing a homecoming for Queen. So when she gets here, I'll be back. Queen and Caroline on Instagram. Bye.